All right, so I have some great news to share with you guys today. For those of you having issues with the latest release, iOS 18.4, we now have confirmed information that Apple is working on iOS 18.4.1, and the release of this new update is actually imminent. We'll talk about the expected release date here because... As you may or may not know, iOS 18.4 had a rough start, and we'll talk about everything in one video, so let's go ahead and dive right in. So according to Mac rumors, Apple employees are now currently testing iOS 18.4.1. According to their website analytics logs, some iPhone devices are now visiting the website, and this has been a reliable indicator in the past of software releases to come. Now, this software update may be available soon, as in the past, once we start seeing this type of activity, we see the software update within a couple of days and Mac rumor has reported that this activity has been going on for a couple of days now so the release is imminent but we'll talk about some of the current issues with iOS 18.4 that we hope Apple will address with 18.4.1 and now the first thing I want to talk about is CarPlay issues so if you connect your iPhone to your car via CarPlay and you're having connection issues then you're not alone including myself I had some issues with CarPlay where the voice input just it just doesn't pick up sometimes or even when using dictation using my voice in general just sometimes it doesn't work so connection issues for CarPlay users is a thing within iOS 18.4 and hopefully 18.4.1 will be available soon to address some of these CarPlay issues for iPhone users now if you have a small business and you use those little square kiosk machines to run your business some users are reporting that the app itself is now crashing for many iPhone users running on iOS 18.4 and iPad OS 18.4 and Square themselves has actually put out a statement statement to stay away from iOS 18.4 or iPadOS 18.4 until this issue is resolved. Now, initially it was believed that this was an app issue, but it continues to happen for some users. So it looks like it could be a software issue as well. So hopefully again, iOS 18.4.1 will address some of these issues for the square slash kiosk application crashing issues. Now, another interesting bug, and this one is kind of weird to think about because according to many users over on reddit if you delete an application on your iphone on previous versions of ios 18 and update it to ios 18.4 that app could return and all its data would return to the iphone as well which is kind of weird to think about because resurfacing of apps and data everything together with the software update it just seems kind of weird we had something like this happen previously with previous software updates for ios 18 i think it was the photos application old pictures resurfacing or a while back i can't really remember but yeah the same scenario here where ios 18.4 users are reporting old apps that were deleted previously resurfacing with all their data intact as well which is again kind of strange now the last thing i want to talk about is search within settings and this has been broken ever since the release of ios 18 as long as i can remember so if you search for something here so let's say airdrop right for example it won't populate for some users so this is not something that's happening to everyone, but if you're in a settings application and you're searching for something with the search feature and it doesn't populate for you, keep in mind that this is an ongoing issue. And again, hopefully iOS 18.4.1 will come to address many of these issues for iPhone users. Now, with all that being said, when can we expect 18.4.1? Now, as I mentioned, once we start seeing these type of activities on Mac Rumors website, we see the software release within a couple of days. Now, sometimes it could take a little longer, perhaps a week or a week and a half, but the release is imminent. We could see iOS 18.4.1, believe it or not, as early as today on the 10th, later this afternoon, which is a Thursday. I'll keep you guys posted. Of course, make sure to subscribe and stay tuned here to the channel. Once the software is available, I'll be covering the software and talking about some of the bugs and issues that Apple is addressing with the upcoming 18.4.1. But at the latest, I would say iOS 18.4.1 will release next week on the week of the 14th, but I think it's imminent. I think it could happen today or tomorrow on a Friday, if not coming next week early for sure. Thank you for watching this quick video again i was 18.4.1 now officially confirmed and hopefully it will be coming here shortly thank you for watching and i'll see you guys on the next one peace